Transylvania, the Middle Ages. An evil darkness had befallen the land, giving rise to sinister vampire legends. Until now, the people of Transylvania had grown accustomed to their peaceful existence, secure in the knowledge that their famed hero, Simon Belmont, had sealed the fate of Count Dracula several hundred years prior. Wicked townsfolk, possessed by the darkness, conspired, uh, conspired to revive the King of Blood, Dracula, and now, undead once more, plotted to exact revenge upon the descendant of the family that destroyed him, Richter Belmont. The Prince of Evil viciously attacked the town with his unholy legion. He snatched away Richter's girlfriend, Annette, and her sister, Maria. Imprisoning them in his vile castle, he lies in wait for Richter to attempt a rescue. Richter, burdened by his destiny, left for Dracula's castle with his legendary, an legendary ancestral whip, the determination to save his loved ones, and the resolve to send Dracula to eternal damnation once and for all. Spoilers, he does not. Also, thank you Stephen Sketches for the $1 dona donation. Also, bit of a retcon here with, uh, at least for this version, where uh, Annette and Maria are related. That's not the case. <laughs> All right. Welcome to Castlevania Dracula X, the SNES port of uh, Rondo of Blood. And some would, many would say inferior because the difficulty is greatly ramped up for this game. Uh, but I've not encountered it myself. All I know is that the game itself is quite different from what we got with um, Rondo of Blood. So that's why I feel like it is worth playing and why I did not skip it. So how will I feel about this one when I uh, Rondo of Blood be ended up becoming my favorite classic Vania? Well, let's find out. <laughs> Already it's actually a pretty nice looking game for the SNES. And hopefully you guys can see me fine, see the game fine. I mean, the controls feel pretty pretty solid, to be uh, all things considered. I mean, the town's on fire, but eh, what are you going to do? Oh, we'll just get rid of Oh, dang it. <laughs> I was going to say, let's just get rid of him before he causes any trouble. Okay, that... What the heck? I thought I was inv invincible until I... until it started moving. That's some crap. There we are. Yeah, music's quite nice. I mean, it's, that's not too surprising considering SNES had a great... Uh, Okay, I, I want to go up the stairs, not down. We'll just walk normally then. And so far it seems to hold uh, true to uh, Rondo of Blood, where Richter doesn't actually get any whip upgrades. And already from this first level you can see that the layout is completely different uh, from Rondo of Blood. I mean, we're already getting Med Medusa heads. Ow. We're just gonna stick to this high path. There we go. Oh, I didn't even mean to do that. <laughs> Well, as you can see, item crashes are still in the game. Now, one of the things I do want to do, and we are going to be using save states because this game does get tough from what I hear. Um, I want to I want to get the best ending where you rescue both Maria and uh, Annette. I didn't know that was a pit. At least this guy's familiar. Oh, 
Okay, made it over there. So yeah, if you guys can just give me a heads up um, on when uh, we can expect to see when the when the paths avert, uh, split and we can rescue one of the girls, please let me know that. Uh, Ilo Max Maria as in OP Maria? Yes, except you cannot play Maria in this game. Hello, Wolf. Oh. Oh, that's a fire. Dog knows how to... Why is he making cat noises? Ow. Ah, it was too close. Uh, let's see. Shockburst wants to know if there's any other characters I'd like to see in uh, Smash Ultimate from Castlevania. Uh, he'd like to see Maria or um, Soma Cruz. And yeah, those are good choices. Um, I'd probably go for Maria over Soma. Oh no. Bad cat dog. It wouldn't be so bad if you didn't land on me and shoot me with fire. Ah. Come on, I thought I dodged that one. Ah, oh, I should have item crashed. We were kind of on even footing there. Dang. Well, back to the beginning. That didn't take long. <laughs> and we're still getting the hang of it. Should have item crashed. That was my fault. Uh, Jay Senator wants to know what console I'm playing this on. I'm playing this on the Wii U. That's what. That way we have save states and uh, yeah. And I think if you want to get a physical copy of this game on the SNES, it's pretty pricey. So yeah, we're gonna stick with the uh, virtual console. Apparently there's chicken hidden in the steps in the boss area. Okay, I will keep that in mind. Took a few more hits than I would have liked from Medusa heads, but that's alright. kind of useful for this boss. Eh, 
There we are. I didn't even mean to do the, do the backflip. Meat. Meat. There's no meat. <laughs> ah, dang it. Also, no blood splat splatter. Okay, well... We should be able to do this with uh, the axe. We would have done it before if I had just done the uh, item crash. Or we can keep unlocking this pattern mostly. How to catch me on fire? Bad kitty. There we go. Thank you, extra heart. <laughs> Wow, no, not even a celebration, just boom, there you are. <laughs> Alright. Maria's key is in stage two, but she's in stage three. So as soon as we pick up this key, um we need to uh, we need we're gonna do a save point, and that's gonna be a little rough. So we need to find a key uh here, I believe. Okay, stage two. So what are we in for here? What are we what what should we look out for as far as the key? I gotta say, so far the soundtrack's been pretty awesome. Ooh. Well Yep. <laughs> I was gonna say I'm probably dead. Billy Bob wants to know how often I read chat. I try to read it as much as I can, usually during deaths. Um, it's hard to, like, it's really hard to look at chat while I'm playing this, because they kind of require, it, the game kind of requires my full attention. Let's do this. Immediately regret not doing that again. Man, we got a lovely bridge here. That's all right. Hey, we're on stage two. We made progress. Big thing here, don't jump so much. I need to jump at least a little bit, though. <laughs> Uh, Evan Advent wants to know what I think about Celica being added as an Echo Fighter for, um, um, Robin. I mean, it's not a bad choice. That's not exactly how I'd picture Celica as a, as a fighter, though. I mean, it works, but Celica is able to use a sword. Uh, but Celica being in Smash, I have no issue with. Okay. 
Thankfully, we can keep that moving. All right, we made it into the castle. So yeah, we just need to keep an eye out for this uh, key from Maria's room. Kind of meant to do a backflip, but sure, send me forward. Okay, nothing yet. Where is our lovely key? Shouldn't jump. Wow. Used up on my hearts, but hey, I made it there. The key is in stage three. Oh. Get rid of you. Nah, I missed out on the heart. Ow, holy crap! That's quite the hit. Okay then, guess we're going with Axe. Ow! Jerk! Fine, you go, you stay up there. Okay. <laughs> exactly the thing I did not want to happen, happened. At least the enemies don't respond. Respawn. The. Okay. <laughs> there we are. No food. No meat yet. All right, dog. I know you're on your way. Come at me. Oh man, chicken guys are already here. Oh gosh. Take a little bit more hits than I remember. Hey, there's some... Oh, you gotta be kidding me. I was trying to be careful not to hit him and boom. All right, back to the beginning. King Raikou, does uh, Richter's strutting feet feel slow in this game? He do, he does feel a little slower. Uh, Koopa Dude, am I more excited for Simon or Richter? Originally, I was more excited for Simon, but after playing Rondo of Blood, I'm more excited for Richter. We'll see how they how different they are, if at all. But I might find myself playing Richter instead.
Maybe we got that part down. Oh man, Primavera Socialista Records uh, says, I've never gotten past stage two, still trying to this day. Sheesh. Misa Vera wants to know how many st uh, streams I'm doing per week. Um, a lot. I mean, the reason I'm doing uh, a bit, bit more uh, Castlevania uh, right now is because it is October. And it feels kind of appropriate. <laughs> Um, plus, once we get past this game, we get to play Symphony of the Night. So that's all the more reason to uh, keep at it. Nice. That placement worked out really well. Stairs are messing with me right now. There we go. My goal is just to make it through as many rooms as I can. Oof. Always makes me afraid he's gonna hit me one more time. Ooh, sure. Ow. Alright, loot to self. Don't get hit by those guys anymore. Or you could just, you know, lightly poke me. Retro Ryan, uh, Ryan, uh, will I play um, Castlevania 64? Yep. As I say, eight, uh, each stream, I'm playing every single game uh, that's been released in the U.S. that I have uh, available. The only exceptions to this are... Um, uh, Dracula uh, X, the Dracula X Chronicles, because uh, I don't have a good way to stream from PSP. Um, oh. Oh, what the heck? <laughs> the placement there with the poking was a little ridiculous. My god, he has such range. That is ridiculous. Okay. Oh, what the heck? Stupid guy. That takes a ridiculous amount of health off of you. Did not want to destroy that yet. Kind of wanted to save that until after I kill these guys, but... Hey, we got to the boss. Oof. I knew it. As soon as I was getting hit there, I was like, I'm so in trouble. Dang.
All right. We're going to give this one more solid try, then we'll, uh, then just, I mean, if we can just get to that point without, uh, losing too many lives, we'll be fine, but man, bosses can take some damage in this game. Also, I wasn't really sure whether I should leave them be separated like that, or... Oh no. <laughs> okay, that was close. Yay, I died! <laughs> oh god. Alright. If I'm safe stating, why not just at the boss? Because I feel like I don't want to cheat too much. We're going to kill ourselves, by the way, for dying that early on. Yeah, and in Europe, this name, this game's name was uh, Vampire Kiss. Which I suppose works since Dracula kidnapped Annette. Alright, let's do this without jumping to our deaths. That seems like a good idea. Just on principle. Come on. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Uh, Justin Baker wants to know if I'm a 100%ing sym Symphony of the Night. Yes. Uh, and also, because of that, we are going to... Um, that's going to be our first Castlevania stream where I'm going to have to do it over multiple nights. So, shouldn't take more than three streams, I would think, but yeah, we're going to be on, starting with uh, Symphony of the Night, we're going to start encountering Castlevania games that can't be set and beaten in a single playthrough. So that'll be interesting. Let's keep up this, uh... Nope, you mess up that whole... You, you mess up the, uh... And you mess up that uh, the cross throw and you're done. And if I die here, I might as well just kill myself uh, totally. Because I want to try one more solid fight against that, ba that bat. Jump, throw, jump, throw, jump, jump. Come on, controls. Why aren't you? <laughs> I just felt like I was getting stuck. Oh, gosh. This is, I, I, I'm shocked at how, uh, I was doing fine before, but now we're just having all kinds of issues. I wonder if we're running into that issue where I'm jumping and then hitting down. I'm going to try to keep my thumb squarely on the uh, right analog. Yeah, that's exactly what was happening. Okay, moving... There we go. So I've noticed this game gives me a lot of sub-weapon uh, ammunition. So it seems like the best, really? The best idea is to use as much, uh, just go wild with your sub weapons. Excuse me, I'd like that.
Love the angle on that. Hey, I finally got to a spot where I can get hit. There we go. Up we go. Oh, really? Gonna back up. Cause I knew he was getting ready to do his big old wind up wind up. I don't need to deal with that. Oh. Thank you. Nope, you need to hurry. Ow. Seriously, not cool how they can block projectiles like that. Oh, if I could just get to that meat. We'd be so good. Okay, cool. Killed him before he could... Oh, thank goodness. Nope. I want this. We did it. We made it to the bat. I was gonna say, where is he going? Oh, come on! Are you serious? It left me vulnerable during the item crash? That's stupid. <laughs> I can't believe it left me vulnerable during the item crash. Such a good thing going. Jeez, why won't you go down? As soon as I did that, I knew it. <sighs> okay. Just to save you guys time, well, we're gonna create a restore point, just in case. But I do think I can beat him this time. I got his. I mostly got his pattern down. And if I can just avoid taking useless damage, we'll be fine. And I'm gonna let this guy come to me, so I don't waste the meat. But I immediately wasted the meat.
Whatever, it took two hits, we're fine. go. Now we got the bat down. Ooh, jump over him. Okay. Jeez, he had to finish his attack. That's no wonder. That's why I died. Because he had to finish that animation. That's dumb. See, we didn't need that restore that save point or restore point. Okay, we did it. Stage two cleared. Now is the time where we gotta look for the key and the alternate path. So where, what should I look out for as far as alternate paths? Man, bloody tears now. They just would decide to go all out with the soundtrack this time. Key is at the very end of stage three. Got that, that was there. That's all right, we're on our last life anyway. This is basically reconnaissance. The key is right before the boss. Beautiful. <laughs> well, that's not good if you end up falling like that. All right, let's start fresh. Don't take any ult path. Wait, we want to take, uh, we want to rescue Maria. Okay, we don't want to use any ult paths. Oh, okay, so if I fall down any of the pits, we're gonna save state right before those pits. Really? <laughs> I'm, gonna I'm having a field day with Medusa heads today. I love these guys. I just wanted to see if I had any better luck on the right side of the path. Apparently not. because I have no idea when that thing's going to come. Ugh. I tried to turn around to hit the Medusa head and, well, it didn't work. Oh, jeez. Wow. 
Okay, we're in for some uh, fun. this as fast as possible in the hope of avoiding as many of these uh, Medusa heads as possible. Oh, that was close. Okay, not what I intended, but I'll take. No, no! <laughs> I was so close to freedom. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Level design is... Whew. Level design is definitely brutal in this game. They expect a lot out of you. I mean, unfortunately, I'm learning how to climb the stairs a little bit faster. So we can now make it up here. Granted, the problem with going that route is that I have no uh, sub weapon. But I did learn I can do this. Which I'm pretty sure I could always do, but. Eh. Okay. More of these lovely... Oh my god, the range! <laughs> range of those guys are ridiculous. No! Ow. Oh, thank goodness. They were kind enough to give me meat. I guess the next big question is this count as one of those pits. Oh, so much of the stopwatch. Hey, thank you for correcting me. Dang, I was hoping for meat. <laughs> no meat for me. Hey, we made it through that section. I'll take it. Whack at that thing. Sweet. A one up. I 
I'm not doing too bad now. We got first... Oh, okay. Here's where we save state. We cannot fall in these pits. And you know the game's going to do everything in its power to make us fall in these pits. Such as Medusa heads. And boom! Load the restore point, back up we go! <laughs> Darkness uh, with a dollar ninety nine donation. Thank you very much. Uh, says Derek, my man, what's up? Ah, uh, you know, just playing some Castlevania, continuing this marathon, hoping everybody's having a good time. Ooh, that was close. Well, as long as we stay kneeling, we should be fine. We just kind of ended up here, so I'll take it. There's a long section to go through without falling. I was de I was kneeling. I was kneeling. <laughs> I shouldn't have gotten sent back if I was kneeling. Ah, all right. I'm gonna try this. Do this in one go. One more time, and then I might have to use safe stage just to get through this because holy crap! No, nah, no, no, no! I gotta be more de determined than that. Oop, not what I meant to use. This is what I meant to use. Yeah, look, I got sent back that one time from that Medusa head, but not from that one. Maybe if they hit me from behind? That's the only thing I can come up with. But I don't think that other one hit me from behind. Yeah, look at that! That same place! Dang! Oh, it doesn't always work. Yeah, we're gonna do this all in one go because I want to demonstrate just how tough it is to get through the to this uh, proper path. You have to be on the ball. And remember, unless you die comp- uh, Unless you lose all your lives on this stage, you just have to just do it all again. Worthwhile? No! No! <laughs> Stupid bones! Uh, don't get hit while whipping. Okay. That explains why I was... So that explains why I was getting knocked back. Interesting. Pfft. 
Yeah, sure, let's just go back and forth. I did this completely wrong way, that's why I'm getting hit so much, but whatever. We're, we're, in, we're in this now. Ugh. Johnny A with a $5 donation. It says, I can't wait till, till you play Castlevania 64. I'm very curious about that one because, you know, you've heard for such a long time that Castlevania 64 sucks and all that, but it's I've also heard uh, since then that the hatred for 64 is overblown. Um, especially since uh, apparently the first level is the worst one. Like, after you get past the first level, it gets a little better. So I'm curious about that. My meat. Hey, we made it! I took a stupid amount of damage, but we did it! James Al with a $4.99 donation. By the way, just because I'm so low on uh, health, that's why I'm not uh, uh, creating a, a save state. Anyway, James Al with a $4.99 donation says, Who on Game Explain is the biggest Zelda fan? Seems Game Explain is lukewarm on the series, especially Andre. Do you think he was too hard on Breath of Wild? What's your favorite Zelda game and why? So Andre is not lukewarm. He's our, he, I think he might be our biggest Zelda fan. Um, I mean, we're all big Zelda fans on the team. He just, uh, did certain things about Breath of the Wild that he just did not like. And I can completely understand how he, why he felt that way. Um, but that, that, you know, that's, that's his decision. Um, my favorite Zelda game is Wind Waker, just because I love this, the story and the setting. I think it works extremely well. And, okay, we got our key. We just need to survive a boss fight. <laughs> Against the Lance. Oh, I remember you. I didn't fight you in uh, Rondo of Blood because you're on an old path. <laughs> okay. Where does this put me? Okay, it puts me here. I'm gonna. I know this is my last li uh, life, but I'm gonna. I'm gonna put a do a restore point here, and we'll just go from this point and fight Dollahan. All right, here we go. Oh man, I don't even get invincibility frames. Oh god, he makes me so. Oh god, he makes me so slow. What is that? Whoa, whoa. Ow, how many freaking attacks does he have? Ah, dang it. All right, he has a lot of attacks. That is what we've learned here.
I'm just gonna run. Ah, jeez. Oh, pff. jumped right into it. He doesn't seem that hard. I just kind of need to get lucky with his, um, with his, uh, attacks. I hit him crash with the key. I don't think that'll work. <laughs> I was going to say, I, if I accidentally went in there. The key has an item crash? Really? Oh. You know what? <laughs> I'm so confused. Why didn't this work? Oh man, that was a good spot! We were kicking butt at the end there! Man, we found the right spot! <laughs> I'm gonna say, I don't think the key has a proper... Item crash, but we'll check it out just to see the animation. Uh. Uh. Wait, somebody said there's meat on the left side. I'm gonna go check. Oh, hey, there is. Hey, they're kind of kind. Okay, thankfully his desperation attack does not kill me, but we did it. That's stage three complete. Okay, now we need to uh, save state here because if we die, we can no longer rescue Maria. So, let's kill this fella first. Create a restore point. Make sure I don't make that same mistake I did back in uh, Super Castlevania 4. And, yeah, as you can see, I mean... Nope. As you can see, like, the game is quite different from uh, Rondo of Blood. That's the big reason, like, even outside of difficulty, the level design is completely different. Now, where do we find Maria? Wonder how long we have to survive like this. So much damage. <laughs> She's behind a locked door during a vertical segment. Okay. So we're looking for a vertical segment featuring a cage. Let's see. 
And we'll have to survive until the end of the stage. Oh, good. What the heck was with that extra... I'm just gonna leave. Oh, how far could he go? Man, they are asking a lot to get Maria. This is this is all so we can see the best ending. <laughs> Yeah, we'll have to use the same. We'll have to use the key at some point to uh, save a nap, but we get another one later. ignore them because they won't do anything to me once I off screen them so we can just keep moving unfortunately if you hit them it seems to cancel out their animation a little different than the older games ah, stupid bat I wasn't sure if I was going to make that one. Oh, thank God that's not an instant kill. Oh my God, you jumped so high. Whatever, I got it. We came out of there with net health. Goody ghosts. There's a door. No. Don't block me. It's my girl Maria. You can't stop me. Made it! We made it to Maria! We can't play as her, but we saved her. But Annette is trapped in another place. Please, save her. Okay, big question right now. Do we still have to say, hold on to the key? Well, I guess first question. Do we still have to hold on to the key? Second question, if I die, do I have to rescue her again? Oh no! Okay, we're saving, we're restore pointing again because according to King Raiko, after rescuing Mar uh, Maria, hang on to the key and use it to enter a locked door leading to stage 5 alternate, then, uh, where you'll then need the key to rescue Annette and 100% the game. Holy crap! That is intense. Uh, that's a lot of ghosts, too. All right. So we're looking for a door. Fleeman. Oh, 
Hey, Fleming, get a little bit closer. Just a little bit, and I will whack you. There you go. Got him. Man, to have to do this all on one life is insane. <laughs> This is how much they make you do if you want to get a, uh, the best ending. And I'm already getting just... Like, look at this. Well, might as well just reload the restore point, because holy crap. Okay, made it through there with limited, uh, little issue. I need that key. Whew. Fortunately, you don't get crushed by these. That part's nice. Okay, doing a little better this time. That is a relief. Ooh, barely got him. Cool. And there's our key. Nope. I need this. Right, at least they don't ask you to go too far. But it's still tough. Stage 5 alternate. Alright, uh, Sam Jam says, So there'll be a water spout you can hit to drain the water and find a net. So keep an eye out for uh, that. Once again, we're going to create a restore point. Because holy crap, the, the things they expect of you in order to get do I get another key because my key is gone I just noticed that my key is gone why is my why is my key gone is that supposed to happen oh phew. King Raiko, you don't need the key anymore in stage 5 alternate. You just need to whip a certain spot to make water disappear, unlocking in that's prison. Okay. Did not mean to do that. Good. <laughs> I was panicking. <laughs> okay, so... It would definitely take a lot of practice. Oh, I remember you. You weren't there until... Uh... until uh, the clock tower, but now, I mean, I guess it makes sense that you would be here. Water skulls. Someone in the chat will know I'm in a place near that. Yeah. I'd be in trouble if it weren't for you guys. Like, holy crap. Okay, sure. <laughs> Did not expect to jump to my death there. To be honest. But hey, we have more lives now. And if I remember correctly, there's only seven stages in this game, so... Thanks to save states, 
we're making decent progress. Of course, if we weren't doing save states, well... Let's put it this way. I wouldn't be going for the best ending if, it, if I wasn't using save states. <laughs> Item Crash is definitely not as good in this game. I could have went for that, but that's all right. I'm getting flashbacks to bloodlines. I'm guessing. I'm guessing this is the room. I needed to move, and I was looking at the chat. That was my fault. Please die. All that and I ju jumped right there. Was that the area? Okay, backflip from the bottom stair from now on. Is that the area where Annette is, or is it a later part? I can't believe I'm, uh, I'm alive. This is good for clearing out all the water, guys. Next room after that. Okay. Should not have taken that much damage from that fish. Right, we're gonna wait. Gonna die soon anyway. Uh, 
Nope, that did not work. I needed to be closer to the edge. <laughs> There we go. Ooh. Get me up! Jeez, I took a lot of damage there. And no food. <laughs> All right, we made it. Oh, I think I. Wow, that's actually super obvious. afraid of falling to my death because you know they would do that we did it <laughs> we saved Annette Richter my love I knew you would rescue me be very careful the count grows more Powerful by the minute. Okay, honey, have fun in your cell. I'm going to go kill Dracula. And just so we don't have to do that again, we're going to create a restore point. And this will be the last one until we reach Dracula. But yay! We did it! We just need to beat the game now and we get the best ending. Not too shabby. Okay, I wasn't sure if I would fall or not. It's sometimes really hard to tell. Oh, stupid thing. Ah, uh, want the cross. <laughs> the placement of that crow is so jerkish. <laughs> Wow! That's Im that's impressively. Hmm. But the reason they put it there is to encourage you, like, hey, buddy, use your uh, axe and you'll kill him. And by the way, there's also health. So in that in that respect. Just in case. Nope. I'm always gonna take it. Alright, we did it! Oh, of course. Oh god, it's the boss. <laughs> He's so much faster in this version. Holy crap. Man, maybe I should have taken the stopwatch. Look at that. Holy crap. Okay. Stopwatch. We want that. Huh. 
Okay. The axe? Alright, I'm seeing axe is recommended. We'll keep a hold of it this time. Get her healthful. Take care of the crows. Okay, let's do this. I can't see him. Oh, wait, is this the safe spot? I just stood up here because he was coming at me. Okay, I'm, it's gonna be slow, but it's gonna be... It's, But we're not going to get hit very often. So, yeah, we're going to stay up here. Okay, he's kind of breaking the cheese factor I had here. Don't mess with my cheese, man. He's messing with my cheese! Too fast for my item crash. Ah, I would have hit him. Got him. We did it. We cheesed the boss. Can't believe my item crash. What? I don't even feel bad for cheesing him anymore. What the heck was that? He was dead. All I needed to do was wait for him to, uh, for them to spawn the thing, which is why I headed towards the middle. Huh. When the game cheeses back. That's unfortunate. Well, we got a method at least. All right, let's do this. Missed him. Where you at? Gonna jump up here to avoid that. Ow. Jeez. Hitbox is a little weird, it seems. We're getting them. What? Ooh, okay. Keep calm. Keep calm and kill this boss.
Ah! Uh, what the heck? And I'm dead. Oh, I'm not! Okay. This is ridiculous. Okay, got him. And I think that actually gave me an extra life. I'm gonna st stay back here. What? Okay. We did get an extra life. He will attack from under me no matter where I'm at and do multiple hits. So I gotta run. I gotta run after uh like just keep moving type thing. That's the sad thing, we've beaten this boss twice now. Oh, now you're getting me with pot shots. I was doing good before. Hey. Jumped right into that one like a dope. Didn't move fast enough. Nope. I even tried to go back so he wouldn't hit me with it when his head dropped. <laughs> wow. Man, that's some crap. We beat him twice! We beat him... We beat him twice! <laughs> Use Axmore? It's hard to use the Axmore when I don't know where he's going to show up, and yeah. I'm just kind of on my own. I mean, I pretty much got this part figured out. As soon as I activated that stupid crow, I knew I was in trouble. <sighs> Pot shots. At least I have two item crashes now. Ah, dang, I was got greedy. One hit, jump away. Yeah, look at that. He, oh, what? <laughs> item crash is almost a detriment. Look at that. That is insane. Suragi Ka uh, Suruki Kage with a $5 donation. Thank you very much. You know the saying, third time's the charm. <laughs> well, let's hope so. Let's hope this third death counts for something. <laughs> Thank you very much for the donation. <laughs> ah. 
Okay, one more hit. Ah, I was hope. Wait, that was enough. Sweet. All right. Move, 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 move. Ha! Ah, you missed me this time. Third time's a charm, as Sarugi said. Again, thank you for the donation. Move, 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 just in case he decides to come back. Okay, we're good. We did it! <laughs> Alright, stage six. Which means there's only uh, uh, two more... Uh, two more levels. This one in stage seven, I believe. So what are we in for this time? Crows. You know, those are always fun. There we are. Mm, I'm gonna go with the cross. I don't know what I'm up against. Again, this game has a really good soundtrack. And the visuals really aren't... The visuals are really good for the SNES. Crows. The stage loves crows. armor oh boy what do we have here ah, just enough to hit me oh that's some interesting platforming thank you help uh, it's not where I'm supposed to be I don't like this. Oh, I, I just feel like I can't jump fast enough. Am I supposed to get to that back up to that upper section? Oh my god, I'm supposed to go to the left here. That's what it expects me to do. Oh, that's evil. And that's just as evil. I hit the one above me. I hit the one above me. Oh, goodness. Well, here we go. Oh, 
Yay for the back for the back uh, hitbox. <laughs> Uh, it took a lot of hits, but whatever. Okay. Do I save state or not? Wait, somebody says you can jump up to the next... That's how you do it. Okay. Thank you very much for that tip. I had no idea you could do that. That is a lifesaver. Oh, thank God we kill him before he hit us with that attack. Thank you, thank you, thank you for that for that tip. Oh, good. Clock tower. Don't have a sub weapon. There we go. Okay. Clock tower. Medusa heads this time, we got bats. Yeah, we're just gonna leave you alone. Uh, oh god. The pain. <laughs> I'm just get I was just getting ragdolled. That's what I get for trying to skip those guys. Oh my god! And I don't have enough hearts. <laughs> wow! That positioning was terrible. Like, seriously, how did they expect you to get past that at that point? Ow. And they give me the most useless uh, sub-weapon against these guys, so thanks for that. There's no good way. All right. Once we get when we get back to the clock tower, we're totally going to save state. Because the uh, the placement of that of the that the uh, spear guy is crap. Because I try to jump off the stairs, but guess what? I'm still too close. And if I even try to worry about that position at all, the bat's going to get me.
Bats and crows. Now here's the thing guys, item, the, item, the item crash for the cross takes 20, uh, 20 hearts. So I can't item crash against them. down here so I can kill you. Ow! Random axe! Ow! Stupid bat! <laughs> no, not bat. It's, that's a crow. Okay. Found a good way to take care of him. That's good. There's meat coming up. Nope. As soon as I saw both bats coming and I how much health I had, I was like, well, I'm done. That's not what I wanted to do. No lives. We're at this point. Yeah. I want to try to have a full set of lives when I get to the clock tower. Ooh, okay. I think the key is I just need to find a sub weapon. Cash. I wanted to hit that. Oh well. Oh well, we'll make do. Come on, Crow. Come down here. Okay. <laughs> About time some things work for me. Doesn't your friend want to dive bomb low for me? Ah, oh, shoot. Messed that up. Ooh. We got our cheese method. Clock. I think I'm good. Okay. As soon as I show up, I'm like, okay, I think we're good on bats. We should be good on bats. And no bat shows up. He's a jerk. <sighs> that was me rushing. Five dollars from Win uh, William Quint. Thank you very much for that. Says, just beat it, Derek, and you can too. Of course, I meet did mine on SNES, but it took an extra d four hours. Pro tip, cheese out, drag with axes. Good luck. Well, congratulations. That's uh, really impressive. 
Really impressive to do that. So yeah, we're gonna use the clock on uh, from now on because I can't handle the bats anymore because I had no issue with them before. But for some reason now, now we gotta send in the pain. I love it when they go into my uh, range. Of course, as I jump, that's when he decides to swoop down. Crows, man, just the worst. Think I got him? We're gonna say I got him. Stopwatch. They still came. It only slowed them down. It didn't stop them. I thought it was going to stop him. So what we're going to do is do what we should have been doing the entire time. Oh, thank goodness. Oh, stupid bat. No! Come on! Ah! Uh, right at the very end. These stupid bats are gonna give me nightmares. Alright. I didn't take damage, but that's a thousand points. I knew it I knew a bat was gonna come up right there. <sighs> I'm on my last lives. I I don't wanna say I don't wanna do a save state here because it's just I don't know what's coming up next and I have so little health and I don't know if more health is gonna come up. I got hit by like an idiot. Ah, this is frustrating. What the hell was that? It's like he had a force with it behind him. I swear to God, these bats are gonna just. Ugh. All right, I'm trying to get there with more lives than just zero. But I'm also trying to, you know, do what I can. Because holy crap. The sheer amount of crap they throw at you in uh, 
in the in the uh, clock tower is ridiculous. Jump the first rock column? Yeah, if we get there with full health, then it makes sense. The reason I've been going that way is because I've been wanting to get health, but actually, you're right. It makes more sense to just jump that first column and say, screw it. Yeah, because this is a decent amount of health. Rugi Kage, jump the rocks be uh, with a $5 donation, jump the rocks before the, the uh, Lance Armor. Yeah, that's what we're going to do this time. I was, basically I wanted to get that health in the far right, which is why I wanted to do that. Mm. Yeah, not even any bats spawned. What the heck? All right. Let's create a restore point because screw the clock tower. I thought I was out of range. <laughs> it wasn't. <laughs> there, I, you know what I just noticed? There is absolutely no um, inv uh, invincibility frames in this game. That's why the damage can build up like it does. Hmm. No wonder it's so tough. No. Oh, come on! I had no choice! He was right there! Thank God we have a restore point. I don't know if I could... Of course the clock tower is the part. Not even carrying the key that far was that hard in comparison. Was even with, I mean, granted, I used restore points, but yeesh. Look at that timing. Just as soon as you get over there. I swear he has more range than the other uh, the other lance armors. <laughs> oh wait, I didn't want to actually continue. I want to load my restore point. As soon as I jumped, I knew I was done.
that's the thing. You gotta take your time, but then you get the bats and you feel like you have to rush as fast as possible. Get on the stairs, Richter, for the love of God. Okay, that one's down. Made it! Made it to the next section! Yay, ghosts! As soon as I was doing that, I was like, I'm gonna fall, ain't I? Whoop, jump the gun. I crouched again. Alright. Let's do it. And yeah, I should have save stated. I was thinking about lives, but screw it. If we make progress, save. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I can use the stopwatch and the bat will still give me a hassle. Well, at least he's backing up this time. Get to see that from slow in slow motion. Alright. I just have to take no hits. Easy, right? Okay, sure, I'll take it. <laughs> Didn't ex expect to make that, honestly. No more ghost? Nope, there he is. Now we'll create a restore point. And use it immediately. I must be I must be crouching at that point. I must be. I don't know what happened there, but sure. Yeah. Totally what was happening. I was accidentally pushing down on the D-pad. Now we're at the Medusa heads. Yay. Oh my gosh, it goes so fast. Oh my god, he just comboed me. Look at look at that. Look how they combo me. Is that it? Okay, I thought that was it. 
That those combos are ridiculous. Again, the reason I didn't uh, save state is cause right away because I had lost a life uh, on one of my attempts. There we go. Baited him to show up. Let's attack. Get back here, ghost. There we go. Okay. Now we'll save state. what we wanted. That too. No, don't. I don't want to go down. I want to go up. <laughs> up is better. Please let me just get up there. That's all I want. There we go. Whew. Safe stating. <laughs> oh, I am so not done. I am so... So done with the clock tower. And you really have to wa whack the wall. Ah. All right. And it's time for death. The item crash just does not do enough damage. Whoop. You okay there, buddy? <laughs> what the kind of attack was that? Holy cow. Ninja death. <laughs> And they give you the knife for this. All right, bring it on, Death. Got him from all screen. Nice. Speed decrease is awful. Oh, I was wondering where he was coming from, and there he was. Man. Death is no joke.
from below. Get down here and fight. I want your second form. <laughs> trying we were trying by the way if we did not item say uh do that we have to do that entire level in one set of lives no <laughs> that's that's ridiculous i think we'll just uh Stick to our um, save states. I was gonna say you're gonna come out of nowhere somewhere. We had a pretty good run there. Oh, come on! <laughs> if only the item crashes! If only the item crashes were actually, you know, effective, <laughs> we would have had them. <laughs> Man. Because that was perfect for dodging him. Can't even jump when he does this to me. Or oh, it didn't seem like it. Oh god, we are doing way worse this time. It's almost like the axe is a better sub weapon for this situation. Okay, well, I got him to a second phase. That's good, I think. <sighs> yeah. Basically, I end up so close to him that I can't help out. I know that I can use the uh, item crash over and over again. That's cool. Shoot. Uh, 
I like how you can actually combo death, kinda. Oh, he went under it. Ouch. Yeah, you almost have to be close to him. Man. Man, if I if I can pull this off without having like let's uh, what I'm going to try to do is just save all my item crashes for the end. Dude, there's no pl guys, there's no place to backflip too. I ha he had me cornered. I will try a backflip in those situations if I can, but when he has me, uh... oh man, why the? Well, actually, I have eight of these I can use without worry. So much unnecessary damage. I'm gonna just try that again. I want a real shot. So here's the thing I don't believe the backflip gives invincibility frames this time around. Come on. <laughs> oh my gosh. Into death onto one of his sights. Okay. Sure. We can play it that way, game. <laughs> Oh man, the way he can combo you, combo you. Imagine having to play through this entire level just to get another shot of death. And trying to learn his pattern during all of this. Why can't I do this when I have the axe? Ah, oh, that's a man. What's with all the size? Is it because I have so much so much health this time? Ow! And I tried to dodge it. Oh, he finally hit me! Oh, come on! I hate when he pulls that. Oh, now you. Mm. Little sparkles? What? Why did they hurt me? <laughs> Why did the little sparkles hit me? Were they the size or... What happened there? Because if I'd known they would have actually, you know, 
killed me, I would have kept spamming the uh, item crash. Okay. No! And of course, he spawns size right there to greet me. <sighs> Always with the just bare minimum of health. Especially if I had actually been aiming the right direction, but I needed those invincibility frames. Dang it. We were so close. Oh, jeez. I realized I hadn't got the other heart, the other heart container, so... Why do I do so terrible with the uh, axes? This should make it easier. Dead. <laughs> One more try with the axe. Oh boy. All right, let's try this again. I wish the axe would hit him on the way down as well. Like, seriously, I swear he spawns more of the size when I have the axe. Nope, oh, jumped right into him. All right. Well, there you have it. I hate that you can't destroy the sides until they're in motion. It wouldn't be so bad otherwise. <sighs> what did I get hit by? There is nothing there! Wow. Wow. I got hit by... Nothing in the air. That's some crap. Oh, 
Oh boy. Yanks just does not work. I don't know why I have so much more trouble. Ah! Change directions on me. I'd really like death to die. <laughs> I can't believe I hit him there, honestly. I swear, I can't jump after that initial, like, time he hits me. thing is is that we were so close that one time look at that the fact that I get slowed down and then juggled by him! I can't imagine Dracula being much worse than this guy. That's the scary thing. Why couldn't I do anything? Justin Kim 420 with a dollar uh, ninety nine donation. Thank you very much. Says Derek, you are the man. Loving the the, the Derek Vania. Well, I'm glad you're enjoying it. I'm. I hope you guys are enjoying this. Uh, my frustration at trying to kill death. <laughs> Where sometimes I can use the whip, other times I can't. When I get when you get, I get hit by death. Ah. 
There we go. There are some nice hits. Please give me your second phase so I can maybe have a chance of killing you. Did you? Hey, we got him to a second phase. It's been a while since we've accomplished that. Well, I'm dead. As soon as I, like, I can get that hit done, but as soon as he was just away <laughs> we were done that's the crazy thing to me Look at that combo. And then he went too low. We were doing so well. Okay. Not bad. Not bad. I thought one more of those would kill him. That's why I went for it. That's why I went for it. I thought, I was like, that looks like one more hit to me. We can do it. We can do it. And he had just a nice sliver of health for that spinning attack. And I had no way to dodge it. That's exactly what happened. We had him. We had him and then the desperation attack got me. So I gotta save one of those for a desperation attack. Ah, uh, What the heck? That's the second time I've gotten hit by nothing in the middle of the clock tower. can't believe it. We had... Chuckles Productions, the backflip does not work. <laughs> there is no... There is no invincibility during the backflip. Ah, I jumped. Oh, I see what's been hitting us that's been invisible. It's a knife getting ready to spawn. Well, at least I jumped over him that time. Okay. 
only get three of these. Yes! Yes! We got him! We got him! Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> oh. We beat death! Hallelujah! Oh, we've done it. Stage 7. How we got from the clock tower to up there? <laughs> oh, I guess we're seeing that. Oh, this is a good song. Wow, last stage and they're throwing zombies at us. Not that I mind, I just find it kind of funny. Kirby Kurosami, there's no reason to save state because we'll start we'll start from here no matter what. So even if we die, we're guaranteed to start here. Well that's the unfortunate placement of the uh Hey, I got extra life. Go figure. Yeah, you, you have fun. I'm going down here with chicken guy. Hey, that actually worked against them. Sweet. Ooh, I didn't even realize there were spikes up there. That could have been bad. Alright, axe armor. Oh. That's not kind. That's not kind at all. Ooh, I don't like that. <laughs> That's mean. Look at that. The level design in this game is just unreal. Yeah, look at that. All right, let's kill you now. We gotta get up there in one go. Oh, with invincibility, that's how you do it. Every time! Every time I try to hit that Medusa head, and it just knocks me down. Oh boy. There we go. Screw you. Ooh. 
Yeah, I think the stopwatch is, even though it's not great. Okay, there we go. Even better. Uh, yeah, we're gonna go with this. Hey, we're fighting Dracula. How many lives do I have? Okay. Oh, right. You guys said to spam the uh, axe. And here's all these lovely bottomless pits that I just jumped in like, like an idiot. Just in case. I'm gonna hope Alright, you guys said this what the heck? <laughs> Logan Middleton with a five dollar donation, thank you very much, says congrats, man. It can definitely some gut clenching moments. If Requiem and Bloodstains uh, sell well, do you think Konami will revisit the series? I certainly hope so. Let's see where this starts you. Wow. Wow. You don't even get put in front of Dracula. That is amazing. You know, it would be nice to fight him when he's actually near me. Just saying. I can only get two in there. Oh, hi. I have thoughts. Yeah, kind of hard to duck when he's uh, spawning on top of me. I'll do my best whenever I'm not that. When I whenever I don't have to get away from him, but. Uh, yeah, I was kind of uh, in a between a rock and a hard place there. Come on, get closer. All right, I missed time that. See, I got a donation out of the corner of my eye. Uh, Beowulf with five Canadian dollars. He says, after having playing, played Rondo of Blood uh, and now seeing this game, my dude, you have my sympathy. This looks painful at times. Yeah. This is... Uh, This has been quite the experience.
Yeah, come to me, Dracula. I can I have all the time in the world. I don't think my axes will reach, and I want to conserve them because I'm pretty sure he has more forms. Oof, that was close. Come on, stop doing that. Stop doing that! I just gotta take those hits. Really don't want to take any more hits. Okay, good. That does reach. I can only hit him with once, but it does reach. Turkey! Turkey! No! Wow. Okay, well, we're learning more. That's, uh, that's something. You gotta be kidding me! I mean, I might as well get the points, even though it's worthless. I wasted the meat. <laughs> Show him to right in the pit. <laughs> like a dope. I can't attack him when he's on that one. I want to keep that meat for later. Okay. So, if he's on the left, two away, do not attack him. Got it. All right, we're damaging him. I was expecting some slow moving fire. He did not send, uh, he did not send slow moving fire. Please stay there. Not there. Next to me. Well, that's a little too close. Ugh. Uh, Dracula sucks.
If we could just keep doing this. Nope. Well, I can hit him from there now. I should have got out of the way, but I wasn't prepared. Dude, get close to me. Ah, too close. That was actually a pretty decent one. We were doing well. Other than the mess up with meat earlier. I'm not going to attack him there because I don't want to waste my meat. Boy, this is an entertaining boss fight. I sure do get to do a lot. Oh my god. Slowly but surely, we'll do this. Or he'll just hit us right into the pit, because I wasn't prepared for his uh, Dark Ball attack. Like, this is the best spot, but he never appears near it. Sure, why not? It didn't hit him. It's stuff like this that makes you tempted to just move more. I'm a little too, being a little too slow. As soon as he opened up for the Dark Ball attack, I knew I was done. This is definitely one of the worst death uh, Dracula fights. And almost, and almost, wor almost the worst one in some ways. I mean, yeah, the adventure one was pretty crap as well, but... At least you were being active. This one, you're just... 
constantly waiting. And one wrong move, and you're dead. Or wasting your meat. Right before you need it. Say two or three more hits. Yeah, two more hits. All right, here's his new form. Is there anything I can do? Like, what is the strategy there? Like, I was hitting him on, as much as I could, but I'm guessing I just have to span and hope I don't get knocked off. Whoops. far away. Okay, don't let him get up uh get above me. Got it. Otherwise spam and pray. Got it. Can't hit that one. That's where my meat is. I was hoping to get a third one in, but not quite. No, no, come on, come on. Oh, stupid freaking Dracula. Oh, man. I really hope he doesn't have a third form. Somebody said save state. I'm tempted. I'm very tempted, but I'm I'm not for now.
Gonna give the, the second form one more tr try without doing the uh, save state. And then we'll do it. If he uses the balls there, I am dead. <laughs> no two ways about it. Again, as a reminder, if you fail this in the normal game, you have to go all the way back to the beginning of this uh, of this level. There is no uh, staircase. Oh good, I didn't hit him at all. Three hits, nice. Please show up closer to me and not on that side. <laughs> Don't tempt me, Dracula. I want to kill you with and preserve my meat. There we are. Two more hits. I had him. I had him. I had him. Well, I would have had him if I could have got to the left side. Because then we would have had to hit... Uh, then we would have had meat. And that would have preserved just enough to in order to take him down. Two dollars from uh, Epic Poo. Kick his butt. I'm trying. I am certainly doing my best. Little by little, we're getting killed. <laughs> I was just about to have a message of hope, and Dracula's like, nope. Also, almost a thousand people watching my pain right now. Thank you. You make it all worth it. <laughs> oh, goodness.
Alright, good start. If we can just stay nearby, that'd be wonderful. I realize it's probably better to duck during all of this just in case he sends out those balls because I can jump jump a little too fast I was gonna say because I can jump faster than I can duck for some reason Ugh. That was a good one, too. faster he goes down when he actually shows up in the places he's supposed to. Waste my meat. Come on, you can do it. All right, two more hits. Got him. I was stuck and I was trying my best. But every time, if I could just get him on the right side, we'd be golden. That's all we need. So maybe that's what I should do from now on. If that, for that final hit, keep him on the right side. I was trying to time it with the, the, the fireballs. That's all. 
Oh boy. Got him. I couldn't jump. I had him. I had him. I had him. Oh, <laughs> I had him. I could feel it. I spent too much time tr time trying to get the meat. That was my problem that time. And I was out of... I was out of uh, hearts to do the item crash, I believe. Oh no! greedy there. <sighs> Come on, Dracula. Show up where I need you to. Not there. Also, uh, Omni, RC Omni's in the chat. Apparently he's been watching most of the time, just been busy up to this point. But thank you for joining, nonetheless. Hopefully we can end this off with some victory. I had to take that hit. Well, that time I tried to hit him and I didn't do it. And that time he's on the wrong side. Right side, Dracula. <laughs> reason I can't get that final hit for save my life. Next time I get him in that form, we're, we're, uh, we're, I can do the first form. That's obvious. I have nothing to prove with that. At this point, it's just a matter of getting to that thing. So I'm just going to save. I'm finally going to save state. Once I get to the second form, because... Look at that. It's just... I'm tired of wasting you guys' time trying to get through this mess. I've gotten close so many times.
And you watch, as soon as I save state, that'll be the time I get it. At some point, he's gonna show up against me, uh, near me again. There we go. Ah, too late. Whew, that was close. Alright. Just need you to show up on the right side. A little closer to my to me on the right side. I had to take that hit. I got greedy. I got too greedy. But that's all right. We got a save point now. Yeah, I got full health as I died. <laughs> Yeah, I'm sorry guys. It's this is just it's taken too long. Man, even trying to jump over he just this guy <laughs> One more hit. One more hit and I would have had him. Man, I would have been so... Up oh, thank God for safe states. Every time, every time I have to attack him, but he's he gets faster. That's that's the problem right now. He gets faster.
Yes, stay right there. Got him. Not the cleanest method, but I got him. And there we go. We actually see Dracula die in a cutscene. And there's our extra cutscene. And we get, a, we get a hug from Annette as Maria looks on. So yeah, we cheesed it, but jeez, this game was This game is punishing. And not even in the fun way. This is just like, we're gonna stack the odds against you again and again and again and again and just completely just overwhelm you and you have to get so good at the patterns know what's coming know what you're going to be doing and yeah and then that final boss like it wouldn't that final boss would not be so bad if you didn't have to freaking restart the entire level if you lost all your lives uh you have it's a patience game it's annoying but mm, it is uh <laughs> it is it is rough uh, and I, yeah, Rondo of Blood is, uh, definitely, the, is definitely the superior game, um, no doubt. Like, there's good points to be found in this game. There's no doubt about that. It is good. But, jeez, there's a lot of stuff that just kicks you in the teeth. That's, that's the best way to put it. And... But it's, I still wanted to play it because, as you could see, uh, pretty much the entire game is very different from Rondo of Blood. Not in a great, good way, but... Yeah. So, oof. But, the good news is, we're done. We don't have to worry about Dracula X. And the better news is, the next game in the lineup is Symphony of the Night. Also, fun fact, this game is not canon because Maria is not... Uh, the sister of Annette and all that fun stuff. Um, so yeah, Rondo of Blood is the true prequel to, uh, um, is the true prequel to, uh, Symphony of the Night. But yes, next time we stream, it will be with Symphony of the Night, a game a hell of a lot easier than what we've been going through, but, uh, it will take a little while to get through because it's not exactly a short game. Uh, and I'm going to be playing it as if a first-timer because it's been a very long time. And I don't know all the secrets and whatnot. So I'm going to be playing it as, as, as if normal. So hopefully you guys look forward to that. Uh, hopefully, if I don't stream it Friday, um, I'll stream it. I'll start streaming it on Sunday. So keep an eye out on uh, the Game Explained Twitter, my Twitter, which is at BitNerdGX. Uh, Game Explained is just at Game Explained. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. And of course, be sure to subscribe to Game Explained for more on Castlevania uh, and other things gaming as well. Until next time, guys. Bye.